Awesome. <laughs> Hello, my name is Sheree White. I'm Aaron White's wife, and uh, you're here in my kitchen in Vancouver, the downtown east side. Uh, every night at approximately 5, 5.30, different people in our community take turns cooking meals, basically because I don't like to. And uh, we gather around two makeshift tables. Most people are from our neighborhood. Some have come in through the uh, church. I went on a crazy win whirlwind tour to 24-7 prayer rooms around the States last year. And I got to see how others uh, share incarnationally uh, in the idea of cooking. And I came to a point that I realized that my gifting isn't cooking. But there's a lot of people in our community that are very gifted in cooking. And so we want to really embody those gifts within the body. And so many times when we go to church on Sunday mornings, um, we only get to see the praise and worship team at the front. And a lot of giftings uh, don't get utilized. And so when you live incarnationally, and when you live life together, when you break bread together, we remember Christ at the end of every day. When you open the word and remind it about the truth, and all, against all the lies that you've heard that day, um, all of a sudden, uh, it makes sense. It makes sense to share everything that you have. My fridge is open 24-7. My house is open 24-7. And we do this because Jesus says, when you invite someone into your home, when you invite someone to a meal, let it not be the rich. Let it not be the politician. Let it be the poor. Because when you invite the poor to my table, you invite me to my table, to this table. And I can't, I tell you the blessing that I know if I've had a bad day or a good day, the end of my day, that my friends in Christ, whether they're from the Empress Hotel, whether they've been selling themselves on the street that night, whether they've been spending three hours in a war room shift at the 24-7 prayer room, we all gather around because we all have one thing in common, and that's Jesus. And I could not live my life. I could not have my home if it weren't for Jesus and what he's done for me. So I get to share that and I don't find, I cannot describe a greater blessing than getting to share what is already Jesus's in my home. So these are my two makeshift tables. They're not beautiful. They're not elegant wood. <laughs> They're just a wedding gift and a good sale at Ikea. And we just put them together and when uh, we share life together and share a meal together, uh, Jesus is present at our table. And that's why I do incarnational 24-7 uh, community meals. Say hello. 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 So where are we? Dinner. Dinner. This is community dinner. And how many nights a week do we have it? Five, six. Six, six nights a week all here at this lovely table. And everybody cooks besides Sheree. All right, that's <laughs> a plan. <laughs>